I woke up and I felt like, oh God, like I had been drinking all night and I did some fucked up, some messed up, sorry, some messed up things. Um, or said some things I shouldn't have said. Hi, Casa Vegas. Can you guys hear me okay? <clears throat> Jean does sharp farts, black beauty. I wasn't drunk. Mac and cheese in the closet. <laughs> so there is. I um, didn't mean to say that about Shannon. Like, I think I was just saying what happened, but then I was like, oh yeah, well, she outed me. Like, kind of like petty like that. Because I am very hurt by what she did, obviously. <sighs> Maybe her intentions are to keep me safe. But I'm st still hurt that she did that because... Like, if you can't trust your best friend, who can you trust, right? Nobody. That's how I feel right now. I got way too messed up, and I see it. Yeah, I see it as a bit of a problem that... You know, that I have to be like that. I don't know, I get just too much. Like, it's like all or nothing for me, you know? And I downed, like, five sausages. If you did coke with Shannon at the graduation, you drove by. Um... I wait, I, like I waited a little while, like like I did some, and then I waited. Like the buzz lasts like 15, 30 minutes. So my impression is you can drive when you're no longer high, right? I mean, I don't know how, what's the law. How long do you wait until after you drive? But yes, I was careless and I shouldn't have done that. You know, the therapist, but I never like she messaged me back with um, a schedule that she would be available for me, and I have to. Uh, get, I didn't get back to her yet. Absolutely don't think physical violence is okay. Maybe I'm willing to excuse it for people I love. I guess I didn't see that, you know, I just think it's weed, it's weed, it's weed. It's just weed is harmless. But it's replacing another addiction, basically. So in, in essence, even though it's not technically an addictive substance, it's become one for me, in a way. Now, am I going to stop using? Probably not. The edibles, yes. Maybe I should stop using those for a while. Or at least, like, really slow down. Oh my god, you guys, look what's here! Come here. Come here. I always find these in my room. Pet ladybug. Oh, sorry for all the hair. Here, let me move this for you. Oh, I know. Okay. <laughs> I love these things. Aren't they good luck? Hi. They're so pretty. Ladybugs. They're beetles. Hi. So lonely, I'm talking to a ladybug. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my fucking god! Why is it on my face? Is this a sign? Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> get off my face! How do I get it off without killing it? Oh. There you go. Get off my fucking face! How do I get it off my face? They bite? It just bit me! It just pooped on me! Get out of my eye! What the hell? It won't leave me alone. Okay. Okay, get off me. <laughs> it won't get off me. Go fly. <laughs> Maybe I smell. It shit on me. Oh my god. I swear to god, it pooped on me. So since I already talked about the thing with Shannon, I'll tell you what really happened. Um, she's not a bad mom. She's a really good mom. Her kid is grown. Her kids are pretty much grown. Like, um, It was just her graduation for her older daughter. It was a college thing. It was just like... You know, like uh, she's going to college and everything. Um, we just did. I brought it and I said, do some with me. So. <clears throat> Am I an asshole for bringing that? Yeah. I was like pretty much in like the full blown, full throes of my addiction with it at the time. I haven't touched COVID. That, I swear, on everything that's important to me my grandmother, everything. I don't, I haven't touched it since that one time. I think it was like July 8th, we remembered. Only edibles, only weed. So whatever else you think is not true.